Well, good morning, Southlake family and friends. Happy and blessed Tuesday. So today I'd like for us to look at Psalm 89, verses 15 and 16, which says this, Blessed are the people who know the joyful sound. They walk, O Lord, in the light of your countenance. In your name, they rejoice all day long. So the joyful t sound, that phrase in Hebrew was a technical word that was used for the trumpet blasts at Jewish feasts, that uh, the purpose of those blasts was to herald or to announce the coronation of a king, but it was uh, also to proclaim at the feast the presence of God, the king of Israel, in the festival, as well as to express just the gladness and the joy of worshipers as they had gathered together um, unto him. Uh, another translation says this verse this way, happy are those who hear the joyful call to worship. So this joyful sound is a call to worship God. It says it's a call to worship for they will walk in the light of your presence, Lord. They rejoice all day long. So the joyful sound that God wants us to daily hear is this call to worship that allows us to walk all day long in his presence and experience all day long the joy of the Lord that is our strength. You know, I think sometimes in a day it's easy to get, in this world we live in especially, easy to get kind of drawn into uh, sounds that aren't joyful. <laughs> you know, the unjoyful sound, whether it's something negative, critical, um, judgmental, things, voices that come around us from the outside, or even voices from our own soul and heart and mind where we feel guilty or ashamed or, you know, we just are under the pile in our life. We are, we're not listening to the joyful sound that the Lord would call us to. So that's my prayer for us today, South Lake family and friend, that you would, friends, that you would hear the joyful sound. Let me read it in the Amplified Version. It says, blessed and happy. We're talking about happiness here, the blessing of God. Blessed and happy are the people who know the joyful sound of the trumpet's blast they walk, O oh Lord, in the light and the favor. It's not just about walking in the light, but there's favor that's in that light, walking in the light and favor of your countenance. So today, South Lake family and friends, let's, let's hear the joyful sound. Let's hear the call to walk in his presence, worshiping him, and may the Lord fill you with his joy today as you do just that. So let me pray, Lord, today, once again, this day we commit all that we are, all that we hope to be, all that we hope to experience today to you. We thank you for guiding us, for providing for us, protecting us. And Lord, we give you praise for that today for us, our families, our church family. But Lord, give us ears to hear the call, the joyful sound. May we walk in the joyful sound today and not any other sound. May we listen to our Lord and may our hearts be focused on you this day. Thank you for the joy that will come as we commit this day to you in Jesus' name. Say amen with me, will you? Well, amen and amen. Well, God bless you. Have a great day. I'll look forward to talking to you again in the morning.